Oh, it actually tastes like Sour Patch Kids. It's crazy. Uh, what's going on guys? Hope you guys are doing great today. What did you do? I've just been like off for like a couple weeks or so only because I wanted to take time I wasn't feeling too well and now I'm a lot better I'm 100% and I want to share with you guys what's going on. It's really cold It's like today's I'm recording this on the 17th and it's basically a blizzard a ton of snow And and when this happens, it just makes me super like depressed and I just don't want to be here in Canada I really want to go travel and such so I've been looking into a flight which is fully paid by my American Express Cobalt card. I blanked it out for obvious reasons, but American Express Cobalt card wanted to share with you guys the benefits, my review on this, because like I've had this about six months and basically got enough for one flight to visit my grandma and grandpa over in the States, California. We're gonna go and share with you guys and talk a little bit about this because I'm gonna go look over some logistics and show you guys my review, my 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 thoughts, my feedback on this, and nothing but good things about this. One thing I want to share with you guys is that I was watching like a, a video about uh, his name's Prince of Travels and he actually reviewed this credit card it was I'll put around here as well to the benefits and such but basically the, the quick overview of my thoughts and review of this is an amazing like 10 out of 10 card only because like there's so many pluses compared to like that one drawback of the card itself I've had this card since August uh, of 2021 and I've accumulated about 51,000 points basically every single time you go to the grocery store every dollar you spend you get five points. Five points at the grocery store, two, two points for every dollar you spend at the gas station, and then one for every other of the place and such, and kind of, they have their own like categories and such, right? if you know how credit card works, this is basically it. One awesome, awesome feature of this card is that you can take these five points though and convert it over to Air Canada or Air France for a one-to-one -one ratio points, which is huge game changer in Canada because like, that just means that every dollar you spend, you get five Air, Air Canada Aeroplan points towards free flights, right? Which is unheard of, which is crazy. Like, I don't know how they're doing this. Like, it's it's amazing. And I love this card for this reason as well, too. The one drawback of this card, though, it is that there is a $12.99 monthly fee. So most credit cards, they usually have, like, a yearly annual fee. Either it's pretty common. It's, like, $120 a, a year or the or it's, like, $150 a year. This one works out to be roughly $155 around there, if my math was right. $155 a year, which outweighs, like I said, for how much points I got since August. It's only been not even full year since I'm owning this card, by the way. And imagine if I owned the whole card like for a full year, not even spend the points I got enough. So give you guys a perspective, right? It takes about 12.5 thousand points to go fly from Toronto YYZ over to LAX in Los Angeles, which is where I'm gonna go visit my grandma. And so 12,000 points for one way, one way, okay? So that's about 25,000 points total. 25,000 points. That leaves me another 25,000 points for something else that I can save for. Uh, I could probably take another trip to to there or probably go to BC this time of year. But the thing is, like, I really want to get out of this weather because I get super weather depressed. I just do not want to be here. I do want, even just like me and my girlfriend were thinking about like about 10 days or so, we're going to go and hang out with my grandma, um, enjoy and see what Santa Monica is all about, eat some like In-N-Out burgers. We're going to go do some of that. But again, fully paid for, right? I think I have to pay like some like logistics fee or something like that. I was looking through like the, the flights and such, but it's crazy that this is only, the only drawback is the $12.99 a month, which is crazy. And I love it. I, I, I love, there's so many positive things about this card. I just, like I said, I'm gonna show you my Aeroplan card um, over here. So here, so hopefully you guys can see that. Um, right there, 50, 1,000 points that I converted over from this card, from spending my regular spendings. It's crazy. My primary card now, definitely one of my primary cards that I use now all the time. Honestly, my full honest review and thoughts of this card is that it's an amazing card. I don't know how they're doing this, but like again, like I, I've just converted the points over. It's just an amazing card overall. Like again, if you apply for it right now, like if you can use it, I will put in my link in the bottom for you guys as well too. If you're looking to go and apply for it, you can actually share the points. If you sign up right away using like my referral code, you can actually get an extra 5,000 points if I read correctly. Uh, we're gonna go take a look at that, but yes, I hope you guys look into this as well too because I guess like getting free flights and going to go travel and then for free and just bring some spending money is it's a good feeling, right? It's a good feeling and it makes me feel that like you know it's just like you're being frugal and such like that, you're figuring out all ways and how to maximize your dollars. And by far, 
this Canadian American Express Cobalt card is one of the best cards out there at the moment. I really like it. I'm going to keep you guys posted about that whenever I see a credit card that's that's worthwhile, that's worth getting. And so this is a, one of those cards that I think you should get. Anyways, guys, if you guys found this very useful, uh, remember to like, subscribe, share, and everything like that. Um, this is just my full review on the American Express Cobalt card. And then again, if you guys want to look more into it, go look at the uh, Prince of Travel uh, video as well too. I'm going to put it around here as well too. And yeah, hope you guys have a great one. Take care.